Hi everyone, it's Jill Foster here with Penny Black with the next in our video series here on our YouTube channel called Penny B Personality, where we will be introducing you to some of our talented friends whose Penny Black cards leave us all so very, very inspired. And today I'm so pleased and excited that we will be getting to chat with Virginia Liu. As you will see on screen, Virginia's family is her husband, and coming up you'll see some pictures of her family, and she is a mom to two grown children, and they have certainly taken some amazing travels together. Virginia was the office manager for a family doctor for 26 years. She is now happily retired. And when asked what type of home decor she likes for her home, she said contemporary and functional. One thing I especially love about Virginia's work is the happiness that her cards portray. There's always some extra touch of charm she adds to her designs. She creates with an artistic flair that really truly does bring a smile to my face. So as we continue to learn about more, more about Virginia through this video, I will have several of her cards for you to enjoy up on screen. And if you're interested in any additional details or which Penny Black products she used on these cards, I have provided several links in the YouTube description box below to Virginia's coordinating blog posts. I asked Virginia where she creates these fabulous cards and she said in 2008 she turned the guest room of her house into a craft room. She says it started out as spacious and roomy however over the years she's accumulated a lot of supplies and it's grown crowded and cluttered but she says it is full of lovely things though. She loves spending time there as it is her happy place. Virginia started making cards when her son was a baby and he is now 25, but she really got into card making as a hobby in 2008 and she hasn't stopped since. She enjoys the entire creative process of making a card from finding inspiration to trying different techniques to sharing her end result with others. The process is very therapeutic and relaxing for her, which is why she finds it addictive. And Virginia has a lot of fun thinking of ways to transform a stamp or die into cards and making different variations on those ideas. The possibilities are really endless. Since Virginia is not required to put her toys, aka craft supplies, away, she can go back to her craft table anytime, and this is how she finds time for card making. She may spend spend 10 minutes in the morning on a card, another hour in the afternoon, or two hours on it before bedtime. She often finds herself making cards when she can't sleep, and thus Virginia says this is the life of a full-time card maker. When Virginia is getting creative, she likes to listen to her local radio station because they play upbeat and current pop songs, and she says this is how she keeps up with the world. Sometimes Virginia also likes to watch YouTube while she crafts and she also likes late night talk shows because she can still enjoy the commentary and jokes without having to pay full attention to her screen. And I am the same way. I love finding podcasts and different shows that I can listen to without really having to have my eyes on the screen. So I did ask Virginia if she could only choose three penny black stamps to take to a deserted island, a crafty island of course, what would she pick? And she said this is a cruel question <laughs> because she has, um, but because she has to choose her top three stamps would be Butterfly Charmer. She thinks she's made at least 15 cards with this stamp. The script cling stamp, she never gets tired of using it, and collage of wishes because there are so many different sections of this stamp that you can use. Now her top three dies for this deserted island are layered leaves, creative curves, and leaf stitched frames. And if you love any of these stamps and dies as much as Virginia, I have listed and linked them for you down in the YouTube description box below. Now Virginia loves to create with all sorts of mediums with her Penny Black products. However, she tends to reach for Distress Ink, Distress Oxide, and Alcohol Inks the most. For watercoloring, she likes to use Zig Clean Markers and Tombi Gansai watercolors. Her favorite techniques are stamping, die cutting, ink blending, and embossing. 
And one thing I especially love about Virginia's blogging, besides her awesome card designs, are the photos she takes of her cards. I asked her if she has any tips for us for taking photos of her finished cards. And she said because of card making, she's learned how to use a DSLR camera, though she uses the automatic features. She likes to take photos under natural light, and the best light in her house is a room surrounded by windows. She thinks the other key to great card photos is to know one's angles, which comes with experimentation and practice. And I have to agree with this. I think the biggest thing that has helped me in taking photos or card making or anything is just taking that time to experiment and practice, practice, practice. And good thing, the practicing is fun. <laughs> Virginia says that this has been, uh, the photography has been a slow learning process for her. However, with each photo she takes, she learns something new. Now comes to one of my favorite parts of getting to know Virginia better, some would you rather questions. So here we go. Would you rather be 10 minutes late or 20 minutes early? And Virginia said 20 minutes early. She does not like to keep people waiting. Would you rather spend the rest of your life with a sailboat as your home or an RV as your home, and Virginia would choose an RV. She likes to have control over her destiny, and she said if she chooses an RV with her hubby in the driver's seat, she could keep crafting in the back. <laughs> also, Virginia says she can't swim and get seasick easily on small boats, so a sailboat is definitely out of the question for her. Would you rather dance to any song you heard or sing to any song you heard? And Virginia loves to sing songs that she grew up with. And the other day she says she caught herself singing music from the Bee Gees. She also likes to dance to the latest hit songs too. Next I asked her if you would rather have all your clothes fit perfectly or have the most comfortable pillow blanket sheets in existence. And she said she'd rather have comfortable pillows, blankets, and sheets. Would you rather read a book or watch a movie? And she said she prefers movies. Receive gifts or receive cash on your birthday? And she said gifts. Make a phone call or send a text? And she said phone call. Explore space or explore the ocean? And she said she would rather explore the ocean from the safety of a cruise ship. <laughs> Be locked in an amusement park or locked in a library? Virginia said amusement park. And as a side note, I think she's our first crafty friend to choose this option. And finally, eat pizza or eat ice cream? And Virginia said ice cream. As you can see, I think Virginia is just as fun and happy as the cards she creates. It's been such a pleasure getting to know her better. And with that, um, I'm going to leave you with some a little bit of music and more of her amazing cards up here on screen. And if you enjoyed today's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thanks so much for watching.